In Latin, there are two uses of the nominative case, the subject of a clause and the predicate nominative. What is the predicate nominative? Well, first, what is a predicate? In an English sentence, the predicate is everything other than the subject of the clause. The predicate includes the verb. So, in the sentence, the man gave the flower to the woman, the man is our subject and gave the flower to the woman is the predicate. A predicate nominative is a noun in the predicate. However, you already know other cases that function in the predicate. For example, if we said the same sentence in Latin, we would use the accusative case for the flower because it is the direct object. The woman would be in the dative case because it is the indirect object. So when would we ever see a predicate nominative in Latin? A predicate nominative is only used in a sentence that has a form of the verb sum esse, meaning to be. For example, in the sentence vir est miles, vir is in the nominative because it is the subject, and miles is the predicate nominative. The predicate nominative provides some more information about the subject. Here we learn that the vir is a miles, or the man is a soldier. The verb sum esse acts like an equal sign, equating the weir with the miles. Since two nominatives are equated, they must have the same gender, number, and case. The case will always be nominative, because it is the predicate nominative.